morning, Lakeside Vikings. I'm Jediah. And I'm Lucas. And here are your announcements. Do you want to be better prepared for standardized tests? AP, PSAT, SAT, ACT? Do you need to improve your reading, writing, and math skills? Gale presents Peterson's Test and Career Prep Database can help you get started in improving your foundational test skills. And the Lakeside High School Media Center is having a March Madness contest in the use of our Gale Presents Test and Career Prep Database. The contest has been extended to March 31st, 2022 at 3.30 p.m. Prizes await our winners. Five winners will each receive a $25 gift card courtesy of the Lakeside PTSA. Come by the Library Media Center to pick up a flyer about the contest. As you prepare for testing in the end of the year, please make sure to bring your Chromebooks charged in every single day. Also, the DSD will conduct an inventory that requires all students to have your device charged. Next, send any of your announcements to this email right here or just email Mr. Mr. Benningfield. It's pretty simple. Now next, man the street with me. What's good, everybody? It is me, Jadaya, a.k.a. J. Fresh, here with y'all for another installment of Man Street. Okay, so we're going to be asking what you're doing over spring break, basically, you know? This is more little question, nothing too crazy, you know? We would do a skip, skip, skipping PTSA, but, you know, that, that might mess around and hurt y'all. So we won't do that till next week. Let's go. All right, today I'm with... John Beria. How you doing, man? You doing good? Yeah, I'm doing pretty good. That's good, bro. So what you finna do this weekend for, uh, not this weekend, but this spring break, what you finna do, my boy? I'm going to the Okefenokee Swamp. I have no clue what that is. Please elaborate. Oh, that's a big swamp. It's like on the Florida Georgia line. Pretty big. A lot of alligators. You like, you finna mess with some alligators? Yeah, well, maybe a little bit. Probably just throw things at them. They're gonna bite like the whole arm. Like, the whole thing. like, how about, how about like an ear? No, they're gonna just take this or like take all of that, like all of it. Yeah, you enjoy that. Yeah, I will. That's gonna be a great conversation side of when pick up girls. That would get so many girls. You're right. If, be... if that doesn't get them, I don't know what will. I was down here with. Here we are. All right, my boy. What you want to do for spring break? I'm going on Florida, bro. Over. What you what you want to do out there? Go to Miami, man. You know, to have fun. Okay, we'll give, give you some specific. What you want to do out there in Miami? What you want to do? What you want to get into? Jet skin, go to the beach, you know, stuff like that. Positive. I feel like you're lying, my boy. I'm not. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, you lying. You are so lying. <laughs> Today I'm here with? No, I'm not. How you doing, no, I'm not? I'm all right. Doing good? Yeah. That's good. Not much. I feel you. Cool. You got a little boogie. So, Noah, what are you doing for spring break? Nothing. Like, like, oh, like, what? Like, nothing? No, nothing. Not nothing. Yeah. Yeah. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. All right. Thank you guys for watching Man of Street this week. Y'all have a great week. What's coming up? Spring break's, spring break's coming up. Y'all enjoy your spring break. Have fun. Be safe. Don't do nothing stupid. Or if you do something stupid, do it like. Do like a moderately stupid. Don't be like too crazy. Don't get arrested. Okay. Don't get arrested. Y'all have a great day. Hi, I'm Sully here with an album review, and today I'm going to be showing you Caviar by Caviar. Caviar is a four-person alternative rock band from Chicago. They were formed from the failure of a previous band, Fig Dish, who unfortunately failed because of a record label mishap. Caviar saw moderate radio play and success with their most popular songs being Tangerine Speedo and On the Download. Tangerine Speedo was used in the 2000s Charlie's Angels movie and also the 2003 Cat in the Hat. They had another song, Sugarless, which is probably my favorite song of theirs that was used in Gone in 60 Seconds. Caviar is a 42 minute long, 11 track album and it goes as follows. Of the songs on the album, my favorite are OK Nightmare, Tangerine Speedo, and Sugarless. I appreciate Sugarless because it has a really, really good, like, energy. It's super upbeat, but also mellow. It has a really fun guitar and really, really hype drums. And it's just a, it's a great, great song. And then I appreciate Tangerine Speedo because it perfectly encapsulates that early 2000s alternative rock feel. It, uh, it's got a great sample with a flute and this almost choiry kind of part, which feels almost out of place, but they make it work. And 
it's just it's so good at capturing that early 2000s feel and it's feels like you should almost be listening to it on a CD. Overall, Caviar is a pretty good album, but a lot of the songs are unexceptional, and I would give it a 7.5 out of 10. But the songs that are good on the album are really, really good. I would recommend anybody who's looking for a fun album or maybe just wants more of that good, good early 2000s alternative rock to give Caviar a listen. Thank you guys for watching the Lakeside Viking News, and y'all have a great Wednesday. Have a wonderful Wednesday.